My PhD topic is on integrating gender features into neural machine translation systems, which are automatic translation systems. To quickly sketch the problem for you, when you have a sentence such as I'm happy in English and you want to translate this into, say, French, you would need to know the gender of the speaker in order to translate this correctly into either je suis heureux or je suis heureuse. You could say that our systems have a 50-50% chance of guessing the right gender, but that is actually not the case because we are using a lot of data, big data, but big data doesn't mean diverse data. And when we analyze the data that is very frequently used for machine translation, we see that there is an overrepresentation of male data. On top of that, the system does not only learn how to translate or how to use language, but it also learns other things that are presented or represented in the data, such as conscious or unconscious bias in our day-to-day -day communication. This has several consequences for the translations that we generate. For example, a sentence such as I'm intelligent would be translated into the male form, I'm beautiful would be translated into the male form in French, but I'm beautiful but not intelligent would be suddenly translated into the female form because somehow the system has picked up that in this case the female variant is, is more likely. In order to resolve such issues, I implemented a system that integrates gender information into the NMT pipeline and in that way we can have more control over the actual output and generate, for example, the two variants or the correct variant if you know the gender of the speaker.